the golden rule. My brothers and sisters, I found this a lot with some of those, you know, younger people who interact either at the workplace or at the universities with a person of the opposite sex. Before you donate your heart to them, get your folks involved. Before you donate your heart to someone, get your folks involved. What does that mean? Subhanallah. Let me explain. You see, the mind and the heart are the most powerful organs that you have. The minute you give someone control of those two, they can damage you, destroy you and really break you to pieces, shredded. So be careful, be very careful. The heart and the mind, you don't give them to anyone besides Allah. Allah should hold that and that's it. If a relationship is within what Allah wants, then inshallah you will be happy. Within what Allah wants, you can give it. But there are young people at the age of 14, 16, 20, they've donated their hearts to someone and they know that they're going to have a real uphill struggle with their folks. Rather, before you gave that heart, you should have at least got your folks involved or you should have had your plan in place. You don't give the heart until you get the marriage done. Because I know of a lot of predators, a lot. When I say a lot, I mean in their thousands, they will come and say, I love you. And at the same time, they're saying it to another 20 people. And then they say, I love you. I really, I adore you. I miss you, etc. And what happens? We our emotional selves. We don't get those statements at home. We don't get them at home. So when we hear it for the first time from someone, mm, something happened, Bing! you know, mashallah, tabarakallah. And you start thinking, wow, wow. And then they say it again. Wow. And then you start pouring your heart out and giving them details about your life. All this is wrong because you're not supposed to donate all of that before you get your folks involved. So it's a mistake because now they can hold you a ransom completely. You've given them too much detail of your life to let go. And they were busy doing it with so many others. It has happened and you're busy fighting. No, the guy is dedicated and you don't know and vice versa. It's happening the other way around as well. So you need to make sure that you don't just fall prey to a statement or two.